All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms, and data structures, beta. Learn basic JavaScript by building a role playing game. Step 54. All right. So object properties are written as key value pairs, where key is the name of the property or the key, and value is the value that the property holds, right? So this is, I, I don't know why they always make this so difficult to understand, but let me uh, break it down to you like I think, how I think. Uh, so this thing, this whole thing, we're going to use an analogy on this. This whole thing is a car, right? Let's say that the key value pair is a car, right? So the name of the car is going to be it's going to be a Toyota, okay? So not only is the the property called okay, so the property is called whatever the key is. So the whole car is a Toyota and the value of the Toyota is going to be a uh like a Supra, right? Everybody loves Supras. So this whole thing is the car. This is the Toyota. The car is a Toyota and the va the specific car it is is a Supra. Something like that, right? Just to let you uh, in on that. So for example, here's an object with the key of name set to Quincy Larson, right? So here's the property. This is the name property, right? The uh, whole thing is the name property. The key is called name. So whatever the name of the key is, whatever the key is called, is going to be the uh, what the whole property is called. So this is the name property. And the value of the name is going to be Quincy Larson, right? So now we're going to add a pr name property to our empty object and give it a value of town square, all right? So this is how we usually set up the objects, just like we do with the functions uh, like this. It's just that it doesn't have like a name in front of it, so it looks a little more odd, in my opinion. But it doesn't really matter. Uh, basically, this is how we're going to set it up, just so it's a little bit easier to read later. And then we're going to give it the uh, key of name, just like this one up here, all right? And we're going to give it the value of town space square, like that. And that should take care of business. Uh, let's check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 55. And we'll see you next time.